Well, hey guys, I'm back for another video, and today I got a story to tell you guys. This one was back when I was in fifth grade. So, well, there's this Patriots player, okay? And if you don't know what Patriots are, there's a football team from America. Um, they came to visit our school in fifth grade. Like, it was great, because I love the Patriots. And Can't his name was Malcolm Mitchell, I am afraid. Okay? I'm really he afraid. He did get traded, but Just kidding, he wasn't nothing scares me. at the time. So, he was, um, came to our school because he had a reading program, so our school got him to come. And our principal specifically made, like, Big six emails and, like, 50 announcements saying our not to bring a pen today. and not to bring an autograph, and not to get an autograph. So, being me, I decided the only logical thing to do was bring a pen and get an autograph. So, that's what I did. <laughs> I just sat through the whole assembly, he gave up these kids books, um, and I went up to him at the end, and I was just like, can I have an autograph? He's just like, yeah. I was like, nice. <laughs> I didn't say that loud, I said in my head. I was so happy. I had so much going through my mind at that point. I was like, what? No way. And once he did it, um, a bunch of people started doing it with his pen, and I didn't want to get in trouble, so I took my pen back. <laughs> but there was this another girl. That had a sharpie. Let's call her Daniela. Okay, that's not a real name, by the way. But she just she gave him a sharpie, so he just started signing signatures. And when people started finding out, they were like running out of their classes to go into the cafeteria where the assembly was being held. They just like bolted out of the classes without asking teachers or anything. They just went to get autographs, and they did. I came back to my class, like, with a smug, with just the smirk on my face. I'd be acting real smug. And my teacher's like, did you get an autograph? And I was like, yeah, I did. <laughs> he's like, nice. And then the next day, right, the next day comes, he's just like, so, um, Zach, did you bring a pen to school? Um, or to the assembly? Yeah, I brought a pen to the assembly, because he was just curious if I got it. He, I was just like, I should have lied to him and said no I didn't, but I had to say that I did, and once I said that, he was just like, um, you know you weren't supposed to do that, right? I was like, I wasn't. I just played dumb, just hoping it worked, and, um, that same day, I was called to the principal's office, um, during recess. For a fifth grader? That's big. You can't just miss recess like that. So, they made me miss recess to come to the principal's office with that same girl, Daniela, who brought the sharpie. So we were, um, I was just like, I really could care less that I was there, to be honest. Like, what is, how does going to the principal's office fix me from getting, uh, like a signature from Malcolm Mitchell? Our principal was talking, like telling us, asking us box. questions, like, why we brought the, the pen, and you know, whatever we the definitely case, heard the announcements and saw the emails. I really just want to say, no, I really didn't hear the announcement or the I think we're going to do great, I just, I don't know, I didn't say that, I was just like, yeah. But like, I said it so confidently, because, like Anything I said, it, 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 it doesn't faze me that I got, I went to the principal's office for this, because my mom and my brother really did not care, and I knew they wouldn't care. It was either not get an autograph, or get an autograph, and get in trouble with school, but not by my parents. Introducing That's like good for me, because I knew my I'm parents. Quick, they I'll would want this. me to go to the principal's office. They'd get mad. But I went for a good reason in my head. But they they really didn't care. I was pretty happy. Um, I did not hear a word that the principal was saying besides the questions. She, I know she was saying like um, I, what I did understand and what I remember is he was late to one of his other classes, or not to one of his classes, but like, to the other school he was going, he was late, and I, all I was thinking about was me missing recess, kind of annoyed about that, it's just, I really was annoyed about that, so I went back to lunch, and everyone was like, so what happened, I was like, I have no idea, because <laughs> I wasn't listening, and then when I get home, my parents, or my mom, she was just like, so you went to the principal's office today, I was like, yep. And, um, she was like, you know it's not good. I was like, yep. But then my brother, like the real man here, he was just like, who cares? He just got an autograph from the Patriots player. I was like, thank you. <laughs> like, he, my brother, who's pretty strict, he really didn't care that I went to the principal's office. Because 
I just got an autograph from a Patriots player. <laughs> like a Patriots player. He said he would have done the same thing. Like it, it doesn't matter. Cause I'm not getting suspended. I didn't get expelled. So really, I just went to the principal's office. Just got my parents called, and that was it. And nothing really that much. Uh, I got an autograph, and I was so happy. So, yeah, really, Thank nothing you. really bad happened to me except missing recess, which I was kind of annoyed about. But I can get over that. And that was it. That's really all I missed. And, yeah. So no one was really mad at me. It's the principal. Um. <laughs> Next ring's far. Hope you like exercise. I gotta say, now that I look back on this. It was really funny. I like can't get over that I did that. And I, I basically started a riot. I don't know if I mentioned that. I started a riot because um, I made everyone run out of class. I think I did mention that. So I don't need to repeat that. Yeah, everyone ran out of class. So like, I still have that autograph to, the, to this day. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the story. If you have any questions about this story, just comment down below, I'll answer them. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time. Peace.